Hi, I'm Rochelle, and I'm from Melbourne, Australia, where it's 35 degrees during Christmas time. And you're watching As Said By Me. Bam Bam, what's going on? I know it's like super hard to understand me right now, but I'm sick and things are just all bad right now. I want to be able to post 25 days in a row, but I need my voice to be able to do that and I can't really speak at all. Charlotte said that she wants to actually talk about her pregnancy and I don't know all y'all love when Charlotte takes over the channel anyway, so I thought it'd be a good idea because she's been asking on Instagram for like pregnancy remedies and stuff because she just hasn't, she just hasn't been feeling well and this is how she felt when she had Maddie too, so. I wonder if it's gonna be a girl again. Are you here? But anyways. Okay, great. I'll bring it out. Okay, great. Thank you so much. Charlotte's DoorDash is here. I'm gonna go get it. Oh, the guy's actually right there. Should we, should we film? No. <laughs> I'll get it for you. Thank you. I was feeling really good about talking to you guys, and now I just I feel nauseous, man. Did he bring a soda? Is it soda? It was supposed to be. If he didn't, it's okay. Is there one in there? No. Dang. It's okay. I can run and go get him. You wanna no, chase him? I'm gonna chase him. I'm gonna chase him. I'm gonna chase him. No, he's already in the car. I just wonder if he even got it. He's just sitting there. I can go talk to him. No, 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 don't. I don't wanna make him feel bad. So I don't wanna make him feel bad. He probably just didn't even get it. Yo. So it's like, yo. He just yelled at him. The dude's in his car. Leave him be. Uh oh, I bet the guy's nervous. See, I know it. He just forgot it. Okay. <laughs> he said running back inside. <laughs> Don't slip. It's slippery. That'd be kind of funny. Okay. No. He didn't, I know. I saw. He said he could go get it. No, I told him not worry about it. I'll make him fix that. No, I know. That's what I said. Do you want to fix the frame? All right, guys. So I am officially nine weeks pregnant today. So only 31 ish to go and I am feeling nauseous and I'm tired and I've been trying like lots of different things for nausea I've done lemon lemonade ginger preggy pop sea bands peppermint you name it I've tried it so I asked Instagram y'all had some good ideas that I'm gonna try some people said pickle juice like I don't know about that one. Someone told me to sleep for three months. I'd love to, but Maddie would not like me to. But the pregnancy is going well. We've been to the doctor twice. I know you guys have seen one of the appointments and I think Seth's gonna show you the second appointment soon. Um, but we'll go back to the doctor in three weeks for my 12 week appointment. We get to see the baby again then. And I think like more blood work, just, pokes and prods all the way. I, I have terrible veins and I got a bruise from my first blood draw. But yeah, everything's going well. I'm healthy, I'm tired, I'm nauseous, but everyone keeps telling me that's a good thing. It doesn't feel like a good thing. Maddie is doing super well. She's officially done breastfeeding, which kind of makes me sad sometimes. Like, I it's crazy because I had been asking for my body back for so long and now that it's over, I guess I don't have my body back because I'm pregnant, but now that breastfeeding's over, it's kind of sad. And she like doesn't even ask anymore. Like she did last week and then this week she doesn't even ask. So it's kind of sad. I don't know, with Maddie I was just, I loved being pregnant. Like I didn't know it in the moment, but then after I had her, I really missed it. And I'm sure I'll get there this time too, but um, this first trimester, it's just been kind of like a dull nausea, like consistently all the time. Uh, with Maddie, I was throwing up three or four times a day for my first trimester. So it's not like that, but it's just like, I'm just nauseous all the time. And it's harder because now I've got a toddler and I'm on her schedule. I can't just take a nap whenever I want like I did my first trimester, like my first trimester with her, I just slept all the time. And now with Maddie, 
my schedule is around her and so yeah it's just a little trickier but everybody's good said sick maddie's great i'm nauseous everybody's great it's great we're all great <laughs> i just ordered doordash from a vietnamese place around the corner and i'm super excited to eat my veggies in this ginger garlic sauce so maybe that maybe that's why i like it so much because it helps with my nausea i don't know but i love asian food all the time especially when i'm pregnant okay so last thing do y'all think we should find out the gender of this baby or not throughout my entire pregnancy with maddie i thought she was a girl and then the very end i had two boy dreams i was like oh my gosh the baby could be a boy like duh the baby could be a boy so i just wanted to find out and plus my grandparents were in town so it was just a way to include them because they're getting older and they live far away so whatever so we did a gender reveal but now i've heard said say that he wanted to find out at 20 weeks and then i've heard him tell somebody else that we're not going to find out at I've all i've never said that you didn't I've say what said no it's not you y'all probably understand me right now but i've never said that i did not want to do a gender reveal is that right that you did that i did want to do a gender reveal i never want i never wanted to do one when this time? Ever. The Never. first time or this time? You told me this time, you were like, stop, 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 I'm nauseous. That's not funny. You told me this time that you wanted to find out at 20 weeks. And then the next, the very next day, I hear you talking to somebody else and you were like, no, we're not going to find out. You're lying. So what do you guys think? Who did I, who did I talk to? You told me. You that's, told how, me. that's how I know you're lying. Because no. you just said I told somebody. And no, told I said you. you told me. <laughs> and then the next, the very next day, I hear you talking to somebody else and you were like, no, we're not going to find out. You're lying. So what do you guys think? Do you think we should find out or not find out? Pros and cons. You guys decide because I don't really, I don't know. I guess I think we got to do a gender reveal. No. I think we just have to. We did it with Maddie. <laughs> All right. Well, what do you guys ends, think? That ends that topic because we're not doing a gender reveal. We'll Bye. talk about, no, 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 wait, I wasn't done talking. So anyway, oh yeah, send me tea. That's one thing he does to help with my nausea. Thank you, baby. Um, he makes me morning sickness tea. No gender reveal. And then, like